What's up, Vortex Nation? Today we will be teaching you how to pair a Kestrel to your Fury AB. If you have not already watched parts one through three of this tutorial series, there are links to them in the description below. In them, we go over important setup steps you'll need to complete before pairing your Kestrel and using your Fury AB. While not required to operate the Fury AB, a Kestrel can enhance the functionality of your Fury by obtaining more precise environmental data than the Fury AB is capable of acquiring on its own. To ensure the best results, one thing we recommend you do prior to pairing your Kestrel is set your Kestrel's live reading data refresh to two seconds. To do this, you will need to go through Kestrel's Kestrel Link app, not the Kestrel Link Ballistics app. Toggle your Kestrel's Bluetooth on and switch it to PC Mobile. Open the Kestrel Link app and select your Kestrel from the list. Once on the Kestrel dashboard, select the More tab at the bottom to reveal all available menu options and select Manage, Manage Live Readings, Data Refresh Rate, and Set to 2 Seconds. If your data refresh rate options do not display properly like ours, just pull down on the white box. Click Submit. You will be taken back to the Manage Live Readings menu and the data refresh rate should now read 2 seconds. Close the app and cycle the Kestrel's Bluetooth off and on so that it is ready to connect to the Fury HD app. To pair the Kestrel to your Fury AB, open up the Fury HD app and ensure your Fury AB is paired and connected. Then, open up the Pair Device page and tap Select Kestrel Wind Meter. Next, power on your Kestrel and hit the Settings button. In the Settings menu, toggle Bluetooth on using the left or right arrow keys and then press enter to open the Bluetooth menu. You should now see your Kestrel appear in the available Kestrels list in your Fury HD app. If there are multiple Kestrels present, find the one that shares the same name as the serial code on the back of your Kestrel. Select your Kestrel and a pop-up will appear in your app informing you that this connection type is for the transfer of weather data only. Select Proceed. Your Kestrel's Bluetooth menu status should now read Connected, and your Kestrel should now appear below your Connected Fury at the top of the Pair Devices page. Return to the home screen on both the Kestrel and the Fury HD app. Now, open the Environmentals page in your Fury HD app. Under the Sync button, it should now read Kestrel Mode and both the Fury AB icon and the pencil icon for temperature, pressure, and humidity should be grayed out. If this is not the case, press the wind bearing capture button once and see if the app refreshes. If the app remains in either full crosswind mode or wind bearing capture mode, cycle the Bluetooth on the Fury AB and the Kestrel, reconnect, and try again. In Kestrel mode, the Fury AB uses the Fury HD app to pull all its weather data from the Kestrel. To do this, you must press the wind bearing capture button first to pull data to the Fury AB, then press the measure button to grab your range information and send all the data to the ballistic solver. Utilizing a Kestrel ensures you have the most accurate environmental data possible and streamlines the wind capture mode process. Now, if you have any other questions about this process, the Fury AB, or any of our other products, please don't hesitate to reach out in the comments below, on the phone, or on any of our social media. We are always here to help.